Great, thanks. The book actually does... The novelization of this scene is actually much better because Sam actually asks Gabriel what metal he should use. Clearly... And this is clearly... He should be using... Actually, that's that's kind of a contradiction because the bracelet itself looked gold, or at least copperish, and Gabriel said the blessing it was silver. So, huh, that was just weird. Anyway, we need to come back the next day to get whatever it is that we're getting. So we finished off... Kazanu, we finished off the interrogation scene. We went to the lecture at Tulane. So, we used the foreshadowing knowledge that we got from the beginning of the chapter, and let's head over to San Luis Cemetery number one. The Vu. Sorry, I just like looking at that thing. Wait, what? There's another... There's another part to this place? Huh. Let's head over there and see what's there. Malia. Mr. Knight. What are you doing here? Uh, my family's tomb is here. Mine too. I noticed. Subtle. Well, Mr. Knight, if there's nothing else... Don't go. I need to talk to you. Whatever for? I can't stop thinking about you. I've been in your thoughts too. I can see it in your eyes. Mr. Knight, you don't know anything about me. I'm not in a position to get involved. I've said that a million times myself. But this is different. I think we both know we can't fight it. Oh, I can't believe I'm saying this. I have so many obligations. My family is very traditional. You wouldn't understand. Hey, I love tradition. I've seen Fiddler on the Roof a hundred times. This isn't a musical, Mr. Knight. We live in different worlds. Look, I know you've got more money than God. Do you think I care? You think that's why I'm saying this? No, I don't. Why don't you come see my world? I have a little bookshop, St. George's on Bourbon. I know. See? I knew it. You're crazy about me, too. Come by tonight, please. My world isn't so bad. I'm sorry, but there's no place for someone like you in my life. Not now, not ever. Damn it! I think Gabriel is going for the Golden Sombrero. It's a baseball term, look it up. It just basically means he strikes out a lot. Isn't that so horrible? So, 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 so horrible. Okay. Well, let's save the game right here. We're no longer at the lecture. We got rejected by Malia. And let's head out. Head out. It's getting late. Gabriel decides to go home for the day. And automatically drives you straight back to St. George's Bookshop. I don't even have the pleasure to talk to Grace. I guess we just finished everything that needed to be finished. I... Huh, wh Whoa... Excuse me, I'm going inside. Oh, uh, excuse me, I'm afraid St. George's is closed for the day. I'm not a customer. I'm here to see the owner. Why don't you just leave your name and number with me, and I'll tell him you stopped by. Listen, if Gabriel is here, he'll want to see me. Is he here? Really couldn't say for certain, but in the morning... Gracie, say goodnight. Ugh. You came. I didn't think you would. 
I didn't think I would either. Your eyes. Hmm. Oh, I could show you around a little. Yeah, it's not much, but... Please, don't. I couldn't focus on much of anything right now. Yeah, I know. God, what is it about you? Just shut up and kiss me. DGA sex. DGA sex! Actually, if I wanted to see that, I'd just play Leisure Suit Larry. Day four. I spoke to one who smelled of death. He gave me, he gave to me his ears, and crosses that were mocked were made into a veil of tears. I like how all the events just happen in a quick succession. Right after Malia disappears in the corner, the paper boy drives right by and throws the throws the paper onto the onto the steps. In which case, Grace suddenly appears and picks it up and p brings it into the building. All in the matter of uh, ten seconds. Uh oh, she seems kind of pissed. You're not speaking to me this morning. Don't be silly. I just have nothing to say. Did you find out anything about that pattern I gave you? Yeah, I did find something. I checked the microfiche at the public library. I found an article about a murder in 1810. The newspaper published a part of a pattern found around the body. It looks damn close. You're incredible. All that work. Forget it. Have it your way. So, what's new, Grace? Your use of man- What can I- The strap mo- Hey? There's something different about St. George's today. What the heck is this? Have you noticed this guy outside the shop? Yeah. He gives me the creeps. I wish he'd go away. Get the hell out of here. The figure outside does not respond. Get the hell out of here. The figure outside does not respond. Uh, well, let's read... Well, nah. I think I should just call it a day right now. So I'll just save. Start of day four. And that's it for tonight. This is Wadball signing off, saying good night, goodbye, and good luck. I'll see you next time.